welcome to Tamara's Lunchbox, Monday edition. We're back at another work week. Did you have a good weekend? Do anything fun? Ours was pretty good. I do have a, a little story um, and pictures and video. So we will discuss that while we eat. Um, I have a turkey sandwich and some cheddar sour cream ruffles. Um, and I have my trail mix and I have M&Ms for later. Um, first, we, uh, we got to talk to Luke yesterday, but he, um, he didn't pass his shooting test, so he's got to redo that today. So we're hoping he, he's only, he was only a few points off, so we're hoping it will, it'll be okay, <laughs> and he gets to do it today, so. Just keep him in your thoughts and prayers that everything went okay because we won't know anything until Sunday unless he's able to write a letter and actually get it to us before Sunday. Otherwise, we'll wait till Sunday. So, it's kind of sad. <laughs> mm. I did my picture. Mm. Got my mouth full. Mm -hmm. So it just kind of, he needed a uh, self-esteem boost yesterday when he called. He was a little sad over it, so, but I told him it was going to be okay. Every session he was getting more and more, so he was going to be fine, so it's going to be okay. And then, my other story, a few weeks ago, Brian's parents, their neighbor, found a baby deer. Here's a picture of her. And she, um, her mom had been hit by a car. So she was just laying there. And they brought her home and started uh, feeding her goat milk out of a bottle. And she plays with their dogs, their puppies. They have puppies, and she was playing with them. And she's so sweet. So here's a video of her. We I fed her lettuce. Look how skinny she is. I know. So I'll add that video right here. I'll go get some more. I thought she would. Hey, little bit. Hey. Hey. Sweet girl. Sweet girl. Come here. Oh, sweet girl. Yeah. But she's sweet as she can be. Yeah. And her little hooves, they're like that big around. They're so tiny. Everything about her is tiny. So I'm hoping that she's going to be okay. Because it's sad. And, you know, Brian's mom was just like, I'm just worried about her because she's going to become too domesticated. And she doesn't know how to be a deer. You know, she doesn't have her mama teaching her how to do things. So... I 
and they have deer that will come up in their yard. Um, his mom feeds them deer corn. So they just come up and eat some corn and then they go back to the woods. But she was hoping that she would kind of, like one of the other moms would take her, but not so far. But I don't know that deer will do that. <clears throat> I don't know if she, if they, well, for one, it's going to have to be a doe that has had a baby. Otherwise, she's not going to have any milk. So, but then I don't know that they'll let the other, uh, somebody else's baby feed. I don't know. But they call her a little bit. That's her name. Or Orphan Annie. When she said that, I said, what? I said, then we're calling her a little bit. I'm not calling her Orphan Annie. <laughs> but she was sweetest thing. Well, I hope she's going to be okay. But we'll see. But other than that, we didn't have much going on, so it was nice. Had a relaxing weekend. And I can't believe we're in the last week of July. Next Monday will be in our new week. And then once August gets here, the, all the kids will start going back to school. Summer don't take no time. No time to fly by. So what are you having to eat today? <clears throat> Is it good? We had um, <clears throat> wing stop yesterday for supper. My wings kept falling out of my hands. I couldn't hold on them things for nothing. They were so slippery. They just kept falling. I got it on my shirt. So I had to go put spray and wash on that. I told Brian, I said, I'm going to get a bib. I can't hold on to nothing. I can't eat without ruining a shirt. But usually that spray and wash stuff, if you can get it on there quick enough, stain removal thing, you know. It'll do pretty good, so. I've done that to one shirt last week. If I had it sitting there in the, um, on the washer, soaking. <laughs>
I haven't had these chips in a while. They're pretty good. Oh, and if you're doing the challenge, or change your life in 100 days challenge, um, today is day seven. Um... If you need to get caught up, they're out there on another playlist. If you need to get caught up on it. Um, today, day seven, was to write down one goal for this week that you want to accomplish. So, <clears throat> I decided my one goal. Miss. Um, my one goal would be to actually go to the gym and do my walk this week. Every morning. And not do it at the house. Do it on the elliptical at the gym. I got up and went this morning. But, you know, to do, make it to the gym, I have to get up about an, an hour earlier. Than what I do if I'm doing it at home. So, there's a little bit more to it when you actually got to leave the house. So, all right, y'all. I'll show you my bag. Yummy, huh? Yeah. But yeah, I'm going to do this and uh, edit the video. Add in little bits of videos here and all her pictures. And I guess I'll finish out my Monday. So, I hope y'all have a great rest of your day. And I plan to see you here back here tomorrow. See what we got to eat tomorrow. I don't know yet. All right. May the peace of the Lord be with you until I see you again. And take care. And thank you for watching and for joining me for this episode of Tamara's Lunchbox. Y'all have a great day.